Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to PixelHangover.com. Gotta be honest with you, I didn't wake up this morning thinking I'd be doing an Origin video, but here we are. EA released a brand new beta version of their Origin software. I'll tell you how to get it, because only those that are in the beta or have opted into the beta are going to get into it. But what it does, the big thing it adds, is achievements in specific games. Right now, only three, but we wanted to you know, just go around and explain and show you how they're using achievements, uh, they're actually modeling it very similar to the Xbox 360 with a point system uh, attached to the to achievements. So, uh, we'll do a couple things here. So, if you want to get in the beta, I'm doing this on the Mac version, but works the same on the PC. Go to settings or preferences. On general, scroll on down right there. Origin beta participation. You want to click that, meaning any future betas you want to get in so you ch check that on quit origin restart it'll it'll update and then you have to re-log in but that's how you get into the beta all right we wanted to at least explain that so we move forward first thing you're going to notice right here is right underneath your name there's my uh, gamer tag right under is origin points i think i had 80 when i started this video and uh, later on i'll show you what the actual achievements look like so when you scroll past your friends here and stuff on your profile is where you see uh, I, right now I have two games in my origin library and it's really cool it's retro so I didn't I haven't played Battlefield 3 since I updated but it says hey you've earned three achievements uh, should be a lot more but I play most of my sadly most of my Battlefield uh, 3 on the console but I might actually play more now so for achievement horrors here you go so this is when you click into the game it breaks it down pretty nicely it actually breaks it down by uh, the main game, and then if, it, if any DLCs have it, it tells you how much they're worth and how many achievements for each one of the DLC packs. Now, the thing that's interesting about Battlefield 3 is there's there's no achievements for the single player like there are on the console. So I thought that was interesting. It's just multiplayer. You're gonna get this little thing here, kind of explains my, my you know your achievements, and there's a lot more. It says there's a lot more on the way. I'm assuming they're gonna patch it in other games, but I like this view right here. You can actually see the two games that I have, and down at the bottom, Dead Space 3 is the third game that you can get right now that has achievements. But I just really like this view. It seems like a really cool, slick view. Um, so they call them origin points. You can see there I have 80 of 2,450 possible ones. I uh, definitely haven't played a lot uh, on origin. And I'm doing this on my Mac just because it's easier for, easier for me to record. But uh, we'll, we'll jump over to my PC and we'll play a game of Mass Effect. So you can hear the sound that it makes and also see what it looks like in-game. Because those are the two other areas that I think people are, are curious about. But, I mean, I got to say, overall, I think it's very slick, the system they have there. Obviously, really mirroring and mimicking Xboxes. I hope they make a public online for, like, a website so that sites like Raptor can scrape them and, and add them. So, there we go. We're going to jump on over to the PC side here in just a second. All right, here we are in Mass Effect 3. I haven't played much on the PC because I got it free for buying SimCity. But uh, here's what it looks like in game. You bring up a Shift F1, brings it up in game. You can see the achievements in the bottom middle, and it essentially looks like it did on the client uh, because you're essentially accessing it from the client. But it pulls up just the game you're in, which I think is cool, and uh, so forth. So that's pretty slick, nice, and nice and easy. So wanted to show that off. And here's an achievement noise. Listen for it. Here we go. So that was a little noise. It's kind of pleasant. I like it. It kind of fits in with uh, Mass Effect real well. But uh, that's it. And you saw a little indicator in the bottom right like Steam. And that's Achievements in Origin. Brand new. Go update your uh, software if you get the beta. Real easy to do. You can, anybody can opt into the beta as I showed you at the beginning of this video. So hope this helps. I know there's a lot of people who are curious about it. So, uh, you know, thumbs up on EA on adding another, something else that Steam has. And hope they keep building on it because overall Origin's pretty decent little uh, client. So thanks for checking things out. PixelHangover.com.